hello 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 and welcome back to the channel and we meet again and i'm in the same exact outfit and why is that you ask because i really want you guys to get a real view of my changes and i think sometimes when people wear different outfits it's kind of hard to see so i thought i would wear the exact same outfit i wore when i first showed you guys my reviews in my um one one month post stop and then again and I didn't do a two month. This is a three month. So I got the surgery August 29th and today is the 30th. Tomorrow's the 31st of um, October, okay? So I thought I would just show you guys my results real quick. I don't have my thing on right now. I'm gonna put it on after I show you guys, okay? So same outfit, as you can see, same outfit, <laughs> literally same purse, um, exact same everything. So let me show you guys really quick. Um, as you can see down here, some of the swelling has gone down a little bit, just a little bit, just going down. This, I hate this uh, with a passion. I'm having the hardest time to get the swelling going down. I can press probably, I say a good 28 hours. No, 20, 22 to 23 hours a day. I always have it on, okay? Unless I'm in the shower or unless I'm, I'm getting rubbed. You know, my husband's giving me like a massage or something like that. So here are my three month post-op results. I had the mommy makeover, so I had my breast done and tummy done, okay? I haven't had my booty done yet. That's coming next, but let me show you so you guys can see. There we are. You can see it's still relatively swollen. You can see the scar right here. I do like that my scar goes really low my scar is low. It goes way down here, which is nice. Um, it's definitely a scar. <laughs> so it's going to take some time to get that to lighten up. But that's that. Um, I got my work done at Ivana Plastic Surgery. As you can see, it's squeezing funny because I have on a, what do you call it? Like a spank under here. It was just, yeah, like spanks. So it's pushing everything here, making this bigger than what it actually is. But on this side, you can see they didn't really lipo like they did on this side. As you can see, this side is really, you know, there's a nice smooth part here. On this side, not so much. So I don't know what that's about, but when I get my BBL, that'll be taken care of anyway, so I'm not gonna fret too much over it. But I'm not, I don't like that. I, I feel like they, you know, I paid for it. They should've did it. I paid extra for them to do that, so. Anyhow, that is the results at three months post-op for my mommy makeover. So that is my three month post-op results thus far. Pros and cons, the swelling sucks. Um, I did buy some um, lymphatic drainage drops that I forgot to buy those when I did my uh, initial surgery. So I did buy some of those, what else? Um, I'm still taking the like the pineapple peels to help with inflammation. I, y'all, I probably gained about a good seven to eight pounds since the surgery. I'm not gonna even lie. I have been eating out so much because I've been shopping a lot, and when I'm out, I'm not by the house, and then I just get something fast food, and it's just been ridiculous. So I've got to get back on my keto diet so that I can make sure that I'm good for this next one coming up. I'm trying to get the next surgery maybe in January because they said you have to wait six months before you do another surgery. I'm not going back to Dr. Mimiscus. I would love to go back to Dr. Mimiscus for the butt. But <laughs> that plane ride and all that turmoil at the airport, just trying to get a wheelchair and just getting through there, it was just too much for me. So I'm gonna try and stay local this time. I'm doing my research now. I'm in California. There are a couple of doctors in um, Beverly Hills that could do a great job. Um, there's a few in San Diego. I'm kind of in the middle of those two. Um, big cities so we'll see but anyhow I hope you guys are having a wonderful day remember to stay wrapped in scraps meaning we purpose recycle we use all parts of your life and please you guys please 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 do me the biggest favor and click subscribe please subscribe to the channel I have so many people watch I've had thousands of people watch this mommy makeover series of videos and like only five or six people subscribe if you're watching the video please it doesn't cost you anything please please for me subscribe so I can can grow my channel. I really appreciate it. 
and check out some of my other content. I do all kind of things, home decor, DIYs, I garden, I do reviews, I do a lot of things, projects, arts and craft, all of that jazz. So go to my playlist, sis, check out my playlist and see if you can find something that you like. I'm sure you will because I have a lot of stuff on there. I have over probably close to 150 videos. So I'm sure there's something there that you're gonna like. So support your girl, okay? And stay right up to scratch, meaning repurpose, recycle, reuse all parts of your life, turn something bad into something good, okay? Maybe DIY some furniture, change your mindset, do something that's going to pull some good out of any bad situation. Stay loving you, because you can't love anyone else if you don't love you, okay? Love starts with you. Can't love anyone else if you don't love you. Stay loving God, stay loving life, because you're still here and you're breathing. And I'll see y'all in the next video. Bye, guys. Ooh.